For the past 15 years, Global Grain has had an historic partnership with Habitat for Humanity affiliates throughout the country, creating energy efficient, environmentally friendly homes that are affordable to build, operate, and rent. Since 2005, Global Grain has been assisting Habitat here in New York City to envision, to design, to construct the largest and the greenest multifamily complex ever built by a Habitat affiliate anywhere in the world. On September 26th of this year, 41 families received the keys to their new Grun homes in, in Brooklyn. Joining over 10,000 other volunteers, these families literally helped to build their energy efficient complex of affordable green condos that are expected to receive a, a LEEDS gold cert certificate. These low income families will not only enjoy healthier homes, but will save at least 30% on their utility bills. Esther Humbo, a single mother of two who will own one of these homes said, quote, in breathtaking cold days with no heat or windows or doors, in very hot days of summer with no air conditioning or fan, thousands came to work side by side with us. On behalf of my children, Jose and Delia, I say thank you. And I have to say that um, I think all of us here see this as not a single event, but as a prototype for many more of these um, investments in our, in our culture, in our society, and it will become um, something that many people will look at and will replicate. When faced with the enormous challenge of constructing a major new academic building here in New York City for the Cooper Union for the Advancement of Science and the Art, we, they chose to build green. And I have to say, um, they not only chose to, to, to build green, they really saw themselves in a leadership role as an educational facility, and it was important to um, to produce something that represented that leadership. It was a great privilege to be an architect of such an exciting adventure. We have designed a space for the academic community as, a, um, as an idea um, that intends to be flexible, open, and interactive learning laboratory. And I have to say, um, we see the architecture, the building itself is didactic. The architecture itself is a learning tool and it's something that is, um, represents the kind of possibilities as uh, young students understand it and occupy it. We have aspired to create a building that would be strong, distinctive, and innovative as an institution itself. Rank one of the nation's most prestigious colleges. It's an it's a, it's a institution that I knew as a young man had a huge effect on me. The Cooper Union mission is to inspire future architects, engineers, and visual artists. And they wanted to um, encourage them, to engage them, and focus their imaginations on the growing demand for sustainable development, for energy reduction, and for conservation of our precious natural materials. This new educational building will be the first green academic laboratory building in the city of New York, where the entire structure will get a lead rating of platinum. We're very, very proud to have worked with them. And um, it's um, maybe even kind of a pretty building for somebody. Thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, it's my pleasure to, pre uh, to present the uh, 209 Green Building Design Award to President Dr. George Campbell, Jr., a friend and a colleague. <laughs> Well, thank you very much, Tom. I'm, uh, I'm deeply honored to accept this prestigious award on behalf of the Cooper Union for the Advancement of Science and Art. And I'd also like to express my appreciation to uh, Global Green USA, not only for the award, but for all the work that you do that is so important to the future of our fragile planet. You know, sustainability and environmental responsibility were critical criteria for the Cooper Union project right from the very beginning. Our master plan called for a new building that would replace 40% of the academic facilities uh, of, the, of the campus and 30% reduce our carbon footprint simultaneously by 30%, the carbon footprint for the entire college. So after a year-long process, we selected Tom Main, 
who had not only demonstrated an understanding of what's at stake for the environment in developing large buildings, but who we believe had fully integrated sustainability into the broader architectural questions of research, of uh, design, form and space, programming, construction, and institutional mission. Now, for those of you who don't know Cooper Union, uh, we're a small college. We have only 1,000 students. But uh, we're ranked number one this year uh, academically among baccalaureate colleges. Uh, and every admitted student receives a full tuition scholarship. Uh, we're among the nation's most selective institutions of higher education, admitting only 7% of, uh, of the applicants to uh, programs in architecture and art, engineering and science. And as you heard in the video clip, uh, given the incredible creative potential uh, of our students, it's essential that we provide facilities for them that will enable them to reach their, their full potential. Equally important, we wanted the building to be a constant reminder of the social responsibilities they would have as designers, as engineers, uh, as architects. Uh, sustainability considerations are a growing uh, element in the curriculum. And, uh, you know, in engineering uh, and, and architecture in particular. So it's, it's, it's critically important to set the highest standards in our own construction projects. The building is loaded with sustainable features, a cogeneration plan, a double skin with a perforated steel exterior, exterior that uh, uh, responds to the position of the sun. Um, we have an innovative uh, radiant heating and cooling system, uh, renewable materials throughout the building. And as Tom mentioned, the building itself, 41 Cooper Square, is itself a research and pedagogical tool uh, with measurement and experimental capabilities that are integrated uh, into the curriculum. So the project uh, required a real leap of, of faith, uh, a deep commitment uh, to the goals uh, that we set, and uh, an element of su substantial risk on the part of, uh, of, uh, of our community. And so uh, it's enormously gratifying to, um, to be recognized and to be rewarded uh, for taking those, uh, those risks and, and succeeding. And hopefully uh, it will uh, inspire uh, others to come. Thank you very much.